What is going on all my Dragonlings and Chaotix? This is your boy ChaosMade006 here and today we are doing another video with Damien Dragon. Now he is not actually in the video with me but it's we're doing it for each other's channels. Um, so what this is going to be is I'm going to be reacting to Damien's first video and his most recent video. Um, we already discussed what the recent video was going to be so that way we can keep the time wise not like super duper long. Uh, but yeah, we're going to get started with um, his oldest video which is an Assassin's Creed Brother overview that he did um, on June 12th 2014 so quite some time that this one's been out but we're gonna do a reaction to his first and last video and that's what we're gonna be doing today so let's get right into this video and uh, I, I'm gonna be periodically pausing and things to shake out like funny things that I want to say or just like laugh over it so let's get going uh, with the seven minute video Hey, what's up, y'all? My name is Damien, and I'm gonna be doing some video reviews. Oh, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta play the intro one more time, man. That intro just gets me, man. It just gets me every single time. Hey, what's up, y'all? My name is Damien, and I'm gonna be doing some game reviews for the next couple months okay. for the new games to come and new games are out. So let's get started. The game I'm reviewing this week will be Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Now, what I'm doing is, in my reviews, would be, what I'm doing is giving my opinions on the games, how the game can be, can be actually improved, food upon, and how... Okay, bro, um, well, I'm going to stop right here and go into a little bit of analysis here. Um, one thing I realized right off the bat is, so, obviously you can tell that Damien's nervous in this context, uh, he's not really... Uh, doing video content he's kind of like stumbling over his words not really making a point about what he's trying to say um, and if you have to explain what an overview is like I understand it's nice to put it in the context but if you put a game review people know what that is so I, I don't think you really need that it can actually be a little more better Another thing I want to talk about the camera angle, man. This camera angle is so, so sketchy. It's obviously recorded on the iPhone or an Android phone because it's the vertical column. It has the two black sides. It's not full screen or anything like that. It's not like this camera that I'm using right here. It's not like this one. It is nothing like that. Um, so that's a really shoddy angle. Um, I know I used to record off of uh, iPhone as well when I first started, but like it's not the best thing in the world to record off of i mean it does the job but at least at least do it horizontal man at least do it horizontal i know some of those make absolutely no sense because they're absolutely the same but stick with me i had a long day now assassin's creed brotherhood is a free roaming free world game you roam around this in giant world which is placed in europe around the 1500s now you gotta understand, I did not go through the entire game right now. Okay, one thing is I'm like, the game, okay, 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 okay. I haven't synced everything up, so. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> okay, so, like, if you haven't beaten the game, how do you do a review on the game? Like, <laughs> like come on, Damien. Oh, I just want to let you guys know that this is all for fun. Damien and I are really good friends, so <laughs> we thought this would be hilarious for us to do. Uh, but <laughs> how do you do a game review and haven't even beat the game? Like, I understand, like, if it's got multiple side quests. Like, if it's, like, something like Breath of the Wild or something like that, where it has, like, thousands of multi-options to go out and do a bunch of different things. Like, I understand if you just beat the main storyline and then you do a review. Like, you're just reviewing the storyline. That's good. That's cool. You just you gotta say, hey, I haven't beat all the side quests yet. I've done a little bit of this and that. I primarily just went and played the main storyline, and that was it. So, like, you can't say you haven't beaten the game. Oh, and it's not synced up yet. What are you, like, bro, like, bro, come on. All right, let's get back into it. I'm not sure what you get after the full synchronization, so you're gonna have to bear with me on this. Now, the main purpose of the game is to complete Another thing is, okay, Okay, so you're like, I don't have it all completed, um, but you're not going in there with confidence. Like, that's a whole thing about this video. It's like, it's not Damien Dragon at all. It doesn't feel like him. Like, he has so much confidence doing his videos, and like, this is not what his content is. 
<laughs> I just find it funny. Like the first minute, man, it's gonna be so great. It's so great. All right, uh, but you can't, like, you literally can't just sit here and <laughs> you can't sit here and just half. You can't do it half capacity. You gotta go for it. You gotta have pride and confidence in what you're doing, and you just gotta go for it. It'll be the best assassin. I love this game basically because the mechanics. Whoa, the whoa, whoa, hold on, hold on, hold on. I love this game basically from this. Now, the main purpose of the game is to complete your missions. It'll be the best assassin. Okay, that makes sense now. <laughs> I'm like, that makes sense. I love this game basically because the mechanics, how the game actually looks, the graphics are great. Very, very spectacular. I love it. Now. When you're describing something, you need more than great or very spectacular to do it. Like, you need to make it sound like... So, like, honestly, let me go into Breath of the Wild here. Uh, drawing back on that, since I like like Zelda. So, obviously, I really liked Ocarina, Ocarina of Time. The graphics were really great on that game when it came out in its time period. But Breath of the Wild's graphics blow it out of proportion. It's one of the best graphically designed Zelda games out there. It's probably one of the best graphically designed games out there in the world. Now that is what something you want to hear. That is something you want to hear when you're reviewing a game. Because otherwise it's just like shoddy game equipment. It could be like, oh hey, um I'm gonna record this with an iPhone instead of recording this with the actual camera. And it's gonna be fit it's gonna be good. It's gonna be great. No. <laughs> like you have to go in with confidence, man. There are some problems with the game I, I was I can say personally I know some of y'all have seen it but if you haven't really played the game then you don't know what I'm talking about please just listen and you'll know what to look out for when you get this game now I do not need an explanation that I need to watch out for what games fault on um, because every single game has something wrong with it there's always like a glitch or a section that's not completely built in yet so it has lag or it doesn't work correctly like, there's always that one section, like, if you go into, like, let's go Pikachu and Eevee, you play in that game. You go into Viridian Forest, you get the max spawns, and you have a lower up, that game starts lagging because it's not built for the capacity of that many things on the screen at the same time. So, just tell me what it is, and don't sugarcoat it, like, 50,000 times about... <laughs> you have to be like, okay, there's some things wrong with this game, and uh, you, I just want to let you know you have to watch out for this. Be like, all right, every game there's obviously things that have messed up with the game. There's things that don't work right when it gets out of production. And so these are some of the things that went wrong with this game, and this is what I want to note about. Just go on like that. You don't have to spend like 20, 30 seconds on talking about, oh, this game is not good. <laughs> now, when you jump from rooftop to rooftop, obviously you played this game before. Assassin's Creed 1, Assassin's Creed Revelations, Assassin's Creed Legacy on, on Facebook, Assassin's Creed... It's Assassin's Creed Legacy on Facebook. <laughs> like, really? That's a thing? <laughs> oh. So, you jump from rooftop to rooftop, and for some reason, it's clanky. When you jump to rooftop to rooftop, you can fall after you get there. Like, like I said, if you jump... To Visual representations, my dude. Like, if you're gonna do a record, like, if you're gonna do something like this, okay, obviously... Obviously, this is a reaction video, so, like, reaction videos don't have clips edited into them because it's just a live reaction to what's going on on the screen. But, like, if you're doing a game review, it helps so much to have game clips in it. Like, seriously, I have no idea what you're talking about. I could have no idea what you're talking about. I could have never played the game before. I could have found your channel with Assassin's Creed on it. And I have no idea what you're talking about here. Like, you jump from rooftop to rooftop, like, that just sounds dangerous to me. And, like, you shouldn't be able to jump from rooftop to rooftop. And, like, it's going to be risky and, like... Also, the way you describe it, I mean, talk about how glitchy. Talk about how it's the mechanics is messed up. Don't talk about how it's like it's choppy. It doesn't work. To one rooftop, off like a building or something, you jump to the rooftop right next to it. You miss even a little bit, you will fall flat on your back. A little bit of what? Mm -hmm. About six feet to your back, and you'll lose half your life. All right, whoa, whoa, whoa. So, lose half your life on falling six feet? That doesn't make sense. Like, I can understand. You lose half your life from falling from a 10-story building. That would make sense. But if you're only falling six feet, like... I know you're trying to keep it right, buddy, but 
you got to have the measurements at least realistic. I mean, exaggerating is a way to... There's another thing like, oh, you fell 500 feet. Yeah, you're going to lose half your life. You're probably dead twice over. But six feet is nothing. Ridiculous. But the rest of the game, I say it's great. Even though you can sometimes glitch out. The game, the rest of the game is great. But even though sometimes you can glitch out. It's not, the rest of the game is not great if you can glitch out, man. It's still issues with it. Don't sugarcoat it. Just go for it. I don't get it. Like, if you try like this is it. a review. <laughs> like, just go for the game. Like, don't, don't sugar, it's not like Assassin's Creed is like, okay, we're paying you to do this review. This is your first video on your channel. We're going to pay you to do a review of our game. And we know that you're really good at it because we've seen your content. Oh, wait, you haven't seen the content because it's not been created yet. This is the first thing he's done on the channel. So, if especially if they're probably never going to see it, you got to. You gotta just go for it. You can't sugarcoat anything. They want honest, like, YouTube and people nowadays want honest opinions on games. They don't want, oh, this game is really good. You can do this, 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 this in it, and it's awesome game. And there's nothing absolutely ever wrong with it. Well, like, if you go on, like, a live stream and you're playing the game, man, this game sucks. This game is trash. It's so laggy. It's got glitches everywhere. I can't play it. Like, you can't, you have to be real with your reaction, and I just don't think he's being real with his reaction here. To be honest. If something's in your way, it basically, you bas almost look like you go through. You basically, it's basically, it's basically, you're basically, you're a basic white girl. I didn't say the right word, but you know, that's what I meant. Uh, this is why I script a lot of my videos nowadays, and that's one thing I really get on Damien about, and I really say that he really should do, is start scripting the videos. Obviously, this is a live video, and I like to script mine, but, um, see, like that, but, um, I just went, but, um, like, literally every time that happens, you can cut it out, do another take, but if you're doing a live video, if you're doing a live reaction, you can't do that, obviously. If you're doing a live stream, you obviously can't do that. But if you are recording a video, you can redo it. It's not the end of the world. I've redone videos like 50 times. Not even kidding. Like, if you guys have seen my uh, Cyrus video with why he wanted to create the perfect world, I recorded that thing at least 10 times because I kept messing up in it. And I was even reading off a script, guys. I was reading the script word for word, and I still messed up. Like, stuttering is one of the key ways to make people not want to watch a video. What you going with? I mean, of course, unless you have, like, a mental disability, like, a, a disability, a speech impediment or something like that, where you can only stutter. Like, that's okay. That's cool. Good for you. I'm, we're proud of you. We love what you do. And you, and sometimes, and you, if you notice that you go around killing people like I do, you'll see that. If you go around killing people like I do. Just want to let you know, if you go around killing people like I do, bro, <laughs> out of context, so bad. When you go to kill a garg, you, sorry, garg, not kill a garg. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Go around killing people like I do, you'll see that when you go to kill a garg, <laughs> you kill a like garg. garg. I have to, like, garg is so good. Like, he has such My good bad. clips. I have some bad grammar. My bad. You have some bad grammar. Don't apologize for it. Just keep going, man. Retake it. Like, it's one second of the clip. You go around killing a guard. Just redo it. <laughs> if you go to kill a guard, and there's people in the... And he says it like three times. Like, come on. Say it once and get it done. We don't want to hear the same sentence over and over again. If you go around killing a guard, you can do... Uh, if you go around killing a guard, um, you can uh, you can go around killing a guard. Wait, you can accidentally hit... And it's civilian, and it causes you to desynchronize if you hit too many civilians. If you mess up and hit civilians about three times, as I've seen, I've hit... About three times. You don't, like, if you're gonna give us a number, I'm okay with exaggeration. I'm really okay with it. I'm really good with it. But if you're gonna give us an exaggeration, I would prefer to have the actual number. So if it is three times, good for you. If, but if it's not, eh. Make it a believable number, like five or ten. A couple civilians, and I played through three or a couple civilians. Just want to point that out. So you contradict, you contradicted yourself. Contradicted. See, that's what you don't do. You don't correct yourself. You just keep going. 
See, I just did. I just showed you that you cannot correct yourself because you do. You mess up. And I talk with my hands, guys, so I apologize for that. That's why I usually don't do face cam. Um, but let's get going back into it. And so the max number number you obviously can hit no three times. <laughs> Turn your phone off when you're recording. Rule number one of recording. Rule number one of streaming. Always turn off your phone. You hit. If you kill three civilians, you will desynchronize, and that's bad if you're on a mission and it just starts to live from, back from the beginning. That's bad if you're on a mission. Also, a spit take. Just saying, he he's totally totally just glitched there. Totally did. <laughs> Which sucks. Not the beginning of the game. Don't get me wrong. The beginning of the mission if you're on one. And it just totally. I want to say, where did this background audio come from? Like, did he have something like playing this entire time, or is it just like one like twenty second clip, like some it of that? Sucks. Also, but the rest of the game it's great. Atiyah Adetode is fantastic to play as. You know how you can unlock different outfits for the game, like the Florentine. You gotta keep. You can't trip over your words, man. You can't just be like, slow down. That's the number one thing. Like, if you are having trouble with your words, it is okay to slow down. You do not have to go ha when you're talking, because if you trip over your words, people don't understand what you're saying. I'm just saying, just saying. I'll tell you, you have an Assassin's Creed too. You can unlock that. Desmond Miles. You can unlock that. You can play as Desmond Miles and Rome, which is pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Even though I don't even know who that second character is. Rome? Question mark. Like, is it R O M E Rome? Like the like the like the city? Or do you mean like Rome R O A M? Or you mean something else, and I just, or you just mean Rhone, like R O A N E? Like, bro, enunciate. <laughs> he, he looks way, way out of, way out of fashion back then. He looks, he looks like way, way out of fashion back then. This is a game review, not a fashion show, dude. <laughs> we don't care. <laughs> he got like a sore thumb. He wears a white jacket, a satchel, and he's running around with weapons and stuff. Like, who wouldn't notice that? The Raiden cost the Raiden costume. That is a very cool costume. Apparently nobody notices that because I've played Assassin's Creed and you can just literally go and do anything. And no one questions you. Like <laughs> You think it might raise some eyes, but no, it doesn't do anything. I really don't know what it has to do with this game, but If you say I really don't know what it has to do with this game, then why are you talking about it on your on a review? Like, why would you bring it up if um, two plus two is four, but I have no idea what it does with this game. Like, that would make sense. Oh, there's a math section in this game where you have to do an easy math puzzle, like two plus two is four. Like, that would make sense, but otherwise, out of context, doesn't make sense. Don't talk about it. Some of y'all know, I, but I don't. The Al Altier's robes in his armor. If you cannot pronounce the guy's name, don't make the video. Pronounce his name right first, and then make the video. Or at least confidence in predicting this. Well, I said predicting. Confidence in pronouncing the name. Like Altier. Boom. Not Al, Al, Al Tr or something like that. Just go Altier, Altier, whatever you want to call him. Even say that. Altier, Altier, whatever you call him. Whatever the official thing is. Do it. Can You can unlock from the DLC. You can un un unlock from the DLC. <laughs> it looks really freaking cool, but the bad thing is you cannot change the colors. That's ridiculous. If they can allow you to change the colors out the air. I want to I want to point out that you are still talking about fashion in a game where you kill people as your primary objective. Now, I understand if you're talking about the features of the game, but if you're talking specifically about you get this character, and you can not change the colors of his clothes. Like, yeah, so, what? What does that got to do with the game? Like, I mean, I don't expect to have character customization in these games. Like, no matter me. Bro, I wear a lot more. But you can't change the colors outfits, and you can get into a whole mess of trouble, and you cannot change the outfit to help you out. You gotta run around finding posters and killing those freaking notorious guards that takes away 75% of your authority. <laughs> <laughs> so the 
context. Explain, man. You gotta explain what you're doing. <laughs> oh, this is so good. Basically, another little thing you need to do is run around and you can recruit. Dude, you can make a drinking game of how many times it says run around. Like, you could, like, if you, you talk about running around, run around, run around. It's a drinking game. You'd probably be drunk by the end of this game. Just saying. I don't promote that. This is YouTube. We're not promoting that. I'm just saying. We're drinking apple cider here. It's not alcoholic. We're fine. Drinking orange juice. Whatever you want to drink. Drinking some G Fuel. Drinking game, man. You'd be really full of liquid. Assassins. That is a very good and very big upstart to the assess to Assassin's Creed 2 if you played it before Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. That's a game that that's something that Turn off your phone when you're recording. Also if you're gonna mention games in the previous series you've gotta understand how they relate. You can't just be like if you've played Assassin's Creed 2 um and then keep going about the game. You gotta explain what you mean. Like if you played Assassin's Creed 2, you know that this character customization was not available in that game either. But Desmond did get some different outfits and things based on the mission he was doing. Something like that. I don't. That's probably not true, but <laughs> I don't know. Uh, it's been a while since I played Assassin's Creed. Let's keep going. You wanted to prove on why are you the only assassin that you have? You can call assassins to assassinate targets, to run, to kill the enemies that you have if there's a big enough fight, and you can't kill them all. Like, I can, I can basically use my knife. I can just start snap, slashing enemies, going right through them. It's fun. It's, it's just fun. <laughs> you almost swear it's a word right there. You almost swear. <laughs> Alright, one of the biggest things about review game, reviews, and I hate this part about reviews. Alright, so you, uh, for a novice player, you can do this. But if you're a really pro like me, you can do it no problem. Like, I can do it with my eyes closed, my hands tied behind my back, and I'm playing with my feet. <laughs> like, don't don't try to sell yourself. Whoever you're reviewing the game, that's what we want to see. But if you're, you are you know how to play very well, and you start off with this game, call your assassin, they'll help you out through, the, through it. Another yeah, but it, it takes a little bit to actually call the assassins. You have to actually be able to do it while you're fighting, which takes a little bit more skill than it does than just what you have said here. So it takes a little bit more skill to be like, oh, I gotta have people kill people while I'm killing people, because that doesn't work. It doesn't work that easy. It's not as easy as you think, because I never call them, and I, I was fine through the game. You just gotta figure out how to fight. The thing that you can do now is you can renovate buildings for Thieves Yield, the courtesans, and, like... I'm pr I forgot the third the third one. Sorry. I forgot the third one. If you're gonna talk about it, you need to know what you're talking about. And also context, my dude. You can upgrade the thieves guild. What what does the thieves guild do to me? I'm like, am I a member of the thieves guild, or do you have to have a requirement to upgrade the thieves guild? It, is it important to me at all? If I've never played the game, I want to know. My bad. I'm I'm spacing out today. My bad. But I, I am spacing out today. My bad. I do not. Basically, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm making this video on a whim. Sorry. It's very good to hear that the Assassin's Creed, there's no Assassin's Creed game coming out. Assassin's Creed Unity. Go out, pre-order yourself. It's good to hear about the new game coming out. Like seriously, bro. You are doing a review on a game. You're not doing a review on the next game to come. You're not predicting it. You're not promoting this series at all. Don't act like you're promoting it. At least save it for the end. You still got a whole minute left of this video. And man, it's taken me 24 minutes to go through one section of the video. Just saying. Copy. I'm about to go. I'm about to go. I'm about to go get it. Well, pre-order the game myself so I can get some new stuff on it. I mean, I heard. I'm getting new game. stuff on it. Fantastic. The views on party is I've heard fantastic so reviews about it. Of all time, it's the greatest of all time. Yes, I'm a copy now. Reserve it before right. it comes out and money. All right, I can't. I can't watch any more of this. This is just. This is just painful. It's absolutely painful. Let's go back to his channel, um, because that's where I was from. Uh, so that is the latest one. Now I gotta. Uh oh, YouTube is not working. Let's go home. See if we reset it. YouTube, I would love you to work. That would be great. 
So we agreed to do this one since it's only 16 minutes. I'm probably just going to cut through it a little bit. And look at this, so much better. It's got... Already... What's up on my dragonling? I am the... Sorry, hold on. The intro was good, and then, like... Mike is a little shoddy here. I'm like, I can hear this stuff in the background, now, man. And I know that's what's supposed to be there. Your game audio is louder than your actual talking audio. I cannot hear oh, you. It actually worked. Alright, before I let this guy in, as you can see, We've got a couple new, um, new recruits to this, aka a one, we've got Christopher, Christopher Foss, which is the, uh, which is the, uh, son of... One thing, guys, whenever you're gonna go into a game, you gotta know what you're gonna talk about right when you this start. Like, that is the one thing you get to control if you're recording a video. That's his mother. If you're recording gameplay, one thing you get to control is what happens, you what you talk about right uh, when you go in the game. An overseer's office. This is one of the new kids that I was uh, using. Uh, guy was somewhere around. He's been to be my vault protector. I wonder why he's your vault protector if he's at the front gate, man. And I have a lot of fucking weapons that I've been picking up. You've gone from holding yourself back and swearing to just doing it, man. Like, oh my okay. gosh. Let me, let me try to grab something. Um, let's go all the way to the bottom. Three, four, six, seven. To go to that eventually. Here, let me go through and equip everything. Oh, he followed me. Oh my god, he looks so weird. Oh, we've gone for six hours. Wow. I I don't this understand why this, why this game is the one you chose nothing to do, man. Is like gonna suffer at all. It's two and a half hours. Like every time I, I've already upgraded this twice. Well, once I when I built it, and once more after that. You told me you've uh, upgraded it twice. You don't have to explain that what twice is to me, man. Let's, let's go but with this. This is basically the quest that I've been going through. So. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna save us from going for too much longer. I'm just gonna do the outro. See what we got here. Um, one thing I wanna know is, like, seriously? What? Why? Why? Why do you pick Fallout Shelter as a game to? Like, there's nothing interesting about this game. It's just like, oh, let me just build up stuff, man. It's a really lackluster... It's a mobile game, for crying out loud. Mobile games are stupid when it comes to recording, man. Don't do it again. Please don't, don't make another video on this. Real quick question. I don't know when this song came on or when uh, you started playing music. Uh, you didn't start from the beginning. I'm not going to lie. That outro is pretty cool. Did you say what you were doing? Let me... Did you say what you were ending? That you were ending it, man? Did you say you were ending it? Because um, I didn't hear you because the music was too loud. Using the original Fallout games. Please let me know who he is. But anyway. Thank everyone so much. It's your outro music. Please smack the like button and show who's boss and share and subscribe for the glory of the dragon. So you too. Maybe come on more. But from Damien to the black, the big game is all over the world. I will see you. One thing I've always really liked about Damien is I love this outro. I've always tried to copy it when I've done videos on his channel. But one thing about this outro is that I never understand exactly what he's saying. I've had to watch it like 20 times and I still don't understand what he is saying. Slow down, man. Again, you do not have to talk super fast to get your point across. You can just slow down, and it makes the video so much better. Because it's like, leave a like and subscribe to this video if you have enjoyed. Or if you want to keep up to date with everything going on with the channel. Not like, smack that like button, show me his boss, and keep going in on it. Like, 
I don't understand, man. Slow down. <laughs> and also, you're talking too softly. Like, if you're gonna put music in the background, you have to make sure the music is less than the audio output that you're putting in with your own voice. I mean, the music's kitchen. Um, did you credit the music anywhere? No. You gotta be careful. I understand, like, the out. Okay, like, an outro is cool and everything. Like, it's good. It looks clean and polished. But, like, you can credit stuff. You can put links and things on the screen, dude. Take advantage of YouTube. All right, so overall, guys, we have, we've gone through these two videos um, somewhat. I didn't go all the way through the vault one because, you know, I'm not going to put myself through that. So uh, I really do appreciate you guys watching. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure you do leave a like button. <laughs> make sure you do smack that like button. Words come out. If you do enjoy this video, if you do enjoy this video, wow, words. If you didn't enjoy this video, I'm sounding like I can't even talk. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you smack that like button and show it to his boss. Also, subscribe for the glory of the dragon so you too can become immortal. But from Jamie and Dragon, I don't know what the rest of that thing is because I always mess it up because I never understand what he's saying. To you guys all over the world, we'll see you guys in the very next episode for some more Damien Dragon action. But until then, peace, my friends. Always burn it up. But I want to leave you with one final thing, and I, I, I really like this final thing. I really do. I'm gonna, I want to really leave you with this final thing because it's it's my favorite thing about Damien's channel. It's my favorite thing about it's about Damien's channel. It's my favorite thing. I gotta leave it to you. That is not what I wanted to do. Uh, how about this one? Is that what I wanted to do? Yes, it is what I wanted to do. First video. Hey, what's up, y'all? My name is Damien.